The Janet Smith case concerns the murder of 22-year-old nursemaid Janet Kennedy Smith in Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada, on July 26, 1924, and the ensuing suspicions of a cover-up. On July 26, 1924, Point Grey Police Constable James Green was called to the house. Wong claimed he heard what sounded like a car backfire, in the basement he found Smith's body. There was a bullet wound through her temple and a .45 caliber revolver near her right hand. Green picked up the weapon, making it impossible to obtain fingerprints from it. Despite there being no bullet, blood or brain tissue on the walls, no powder burns on her face, and the fact that the back of her head had been smashed in, Green concluded that she had committed suicide. After an inquest, the Vancouver coroner called it a self-inflicted but accidental death. Undertakers were summoned, and instructed by both the coroner and the police to embalm the body, likely eradicating any clues that it might have yielded for instance whether Smith had been sexually assaulted. It was the first time the undertaker had embalmed the victim of a violent death without a post-mortem. He found unexplained burns on Smith's right side.